This hubbub about 3D printing. Okay, what exactly is it? And to see it, do I need to get new glasses? Because if that's the case, I'm totally in. Sure, these contraptions can print up plastic trinkets, but listen, I'm half Italian. 3D printing will mean a heck of a lot more to me when I can print up something like uh, ravioli. Well, move over, Grandma, because here's Allie Ward. Gourmet food, junk food, fast food, health food, and yes, Italian food. The kitchen has seen all types of masters make culinary delights in the sophisticated world of food. But now there is something you might have to see to believe, 3D food. Wait, isn't food already 3D? Of course, I'm talking about 3D printed food. And nowhere does food and technology merge quite like it does in the presence of Miguel and Rooney Valenzuela. Daughters Lily and Maya are enthusiastic about the first meal of the day because of an innovation made by their dad, the pancake bot. That's right, one part pancakes, one part robot. When a, you know, three-year-old tells you to build a pancake machine, you better deliver. That's how it began. So Miguel took his engineering skills and got started. Now, the pancake bot makes any design you choose and it cooks while it prints. A printer and a skillet in one. The result is not only good for young tummies, but also young minds. We just saw a lot of sparkles in kids' eyes. We decided, well, Let's take this to the extent where we can actually use this as a tool to inspire kids to get into robotics, but also to get into learning about how food, which is something that's very personal with people, can combine with technology. I make my imagination to feel like a pancake bus to make pancakes. And Miguel is hoping to someday bring his invention into your kitchen. But 3D food printing isn't just for breakfast. What you see here is not just art. It's culinary art. Believe it or not, these ornate shapes are not Ming Dynasty vases or museum pieces. They are 3D printed confections made with a chef jet printer. Yes, these sugary designs were 3D printed. Using computers and technology to input the creative vision, these hex-centric sweet beginnings become 3D printed delicate vases, cake toppers, and stands, and even the most exquisitely crafted sugar cubes. Sugar cubes like this surely elevate the standard coffee break into something more akin to a tiny gallery visit. Pretty magical. And so is Boudini. This 3D printer with the magic-inspired name can print sweet treats like these and savory dishes such as pizza. Fudini is an open capsule model, meaning you prepare the contents of the capsules using fresh ingredients, put them in the Fudini, and print. Some designs are ready to eat, like chocolate, while others need to be cooked, like ravioli. Yes, you can even 3D print little pasta pockets layer by layer and still say you made them from scratch. Sort of, using a little practicality and a generous sprinkle of science wonder.